you grab lettuce, wrap it in some foil like this. It'll stay crispy and fresh for up to 30 days. You won't believe what you can do with banana peels. The first thing you want to do is put them on a piece of foil and bake them in the oven for 15 minutes at 300 degrees. So don't buy those chemical fertilizers when you can make your own right at home. Okay, our next guest has more than a green thumb. He is a green genius with millions enjoying his crash courses. Look at him there. You, I, I'm like, are you saying, like, what are you, are you signaling I love you? <laughs> I didn't realize that was live. Oh, no. We don't have so, a I love you every single video. <laughs> there you are. There you are. Creative Explained, our men. Uh, thank you so much for being here with us. We're so excited to have you here. Okay, you're in your kitchen where you do a lot of these videos. You use a lot of all-natural ingredients. And I saw a video of you cleaning, actually. That was the first time I saw you. And I was like, I need to implement some of these cleaning hacks. I mean, you was taking baking soda and a lime wedge and scrubbing his sterling silver as chrome. But you, you make this look so easy. Can anybody do what you're doing? Absolutely. It's, it's super simple. And, and, and that's why I do what I do, is to show people that a lot of the stuff that they think is complicated, it's actually very easy. And you do a lot of regrowing of food. Uh, from avocados to mangoes, lime trees in your house. You've got plants all around your house now. Your videos feel like a cool kid science show. How did you get all of this expertise? Did you grow up around a garden? No, not really. I, I you know, I, I've spent the last 12 years uh, creating videos. You know, I'm a filmmaker. So uh, starting off, it was uh, already a passion for me. But now I found a way to combine my love for filmmaking and you know, to help the world through this knowledge. As one of my producers pointed out that there's a little baby pineapple on the plant that's in the foreground there. So you are growing a pineapple in a pot. You, you grew this from a seed. Yeah, no, actually, when you when you buy pineapple at the store and you twist off the top or cut off the top, most people throw out the top. But if you plant it, this is the top right here. Wow. So then it'll eventually grow a new stem and a new pineapple will produce. <laughs> You're, I mean, sustainability, eliminating food waste is so in vogue right now, if that's the right way to describe it. I'm sure the cool kids have another way to describe it. But you recycle everything from potato skins, walnut shells, pomegranate skins. You even, I saw you doing a video, you used dog hair as fertilizer in your plants. So you swept up yes. the dog hair in your apartment, you put it in your plants. What is this? Is it clean composting? Is it like recycling, upcycling without actually composting? It, it's it's really just you know it's a, there's a lot of stuff that you can do with the stuff that we're throwing out on a daily basis. A lot of stuff that we're buying at the store is made from the stuff that we're throwing out. So I just found ways, new ways to recycle and upcycle those things, the waste that we you know, that we call trash. And and it's amazing what you can do with with these things. So. Uh, People are learning, people are inspired, and that makes me happy, you know? <laughs> I love it. Show us one of your food hacks. You have about 30 seconds. I want to see okay, something yeah. that you so can show people. Got 30 seconds, strawberries. Yeah. Everybody chops off the ends and wastes like half the strawberry. Just grab a straw. Ironic, right? Strawberry straw. And poke it through one end like this. Oh, there it goes. <laughs> so it'll it'll remove the stem, and, and you don't waste anything. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> You're a gymnast too, I think, and a juggler. Uh, do we need anything else in our house besides foil, a coffee grinder, and some potting soil to do what you do? Or what else is in our men's toolkit? Uh, stop, stop throwing things out and, and start being curious. You know, start asking yourself: Is there something you can do? That's the main thing. If, if there's something you can do with it, uh, if you don't know what you can do with it, then just look up my videos. Okay, and <laughs> it, and again, it's creative underscore explained. Our men, a Damien. Uh, can we just really quickly tell people, you've got some books coming out. Yes, I actually have two books right now. They're out, they're on plant and gar uh, plants and gardening, but I have a new book coming out, which is gonna cover a lot more you know, variety of stuff, including how to keep your fruits and vegetables fresh for longer. I think the most interesting thing was that you use those banana peels, you ground the dried peels into a powder and made tea out of them. I don't know yes. if I want banana tea, but it's supposed to be really healthy for you. I. I was shocked at some of the things that you've done. I'm so glad that you're able to join us uh, and appreciate your time. And again, creative underscore explained on TikTok and Instagram. Thank you, Armin. Thank you for having me. That's so awesome. The, I mean, the number of strawberries we go through with my little man, it's like we, we, could, we could save a lot of strawberries. <laughs> Thank you for watching. Go to NewsNationNow.com to find NewsNation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of NewsNation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.